everyone, welcome back to episode 9 and today we're going to be focusing on fitting our new headliner into our Ford Transit Custom Camper. So in the video today we're going to show you how to go from this to this. Materials for today, so I've got the um, new ply headliner. This is supplied by Custom Shop Designs. Again, it was uh, CNC cut directly for the shapes of the, the Transit Customs. So this is gonna go uh, straight into the band, nice and easy, hopefully. Um, also over here, got our trusty four-way stretch carpet because we're gonna be lining the, the ply for the, the roof liner as well. And as we are going to be fitting LED lights, I've got the LED lights, which is going to be part of the, the install today as well. So these are going to be remote controlled with a dimmer as well. So going to take a little bit of modification to get these to work. Not done it before, so hopefully it's going to go well and give us a nice uh, finished look. Just in the dry fit of these in the van, and as expected, they are a little bit too tight. So what we're going to do is trim these down around the edges, because once we've got the carpet on as well, they are going to be a little bit wider. So we're just going to take a little bit off um, with the jigsaw, just round all of the, the contours, just so we can make sure that these go in nice and easy. So let's get cutting. Getting ready to line these now, so just going to cut them down to the shape that we need. Um, we're going to get these stuck down with our uh, contact adhesive, um, and then we'll get to the lights. Let's go. So on to our next stage now, the uh, headline is all fully lined and we have a new helper. Uh, this is Mumble, AKA Happy Feet. So uh, my wonderful wife, Michelle, um, she works at a chicken rehoming on a voluntary basis. And uh, this little girl um, came to us quite poorly as an ex-battery hen. So nothing to do with the van conversion whatsoever, but you know, it's nice to have, have helpers. Onto the LED lights now. So uh, what we've got here is bought these from, I think it was either Amazon or, or eBay, some 12 volt LEDs. Um, they come with this sort of control unit um, or connection box actually, where all of the, the individual LEDs are gonna, gonna wire back to that point. Also comes with the module here, which is the, the wireless um, remote control. So these have got a remote with them as well. So we do want to be able to operate these independently. So they are going to be wired back to, to the electrics, but you know, when the power is running to them, we'll, we'll still be able to use the, the remote. Um, these were supplied with a connector um, and this was intended to go back to uh, like a, a connector that goes to the, the cigar or the cigarette charger in, in, the, uh, in the van, but we're not going to be using that. So what the plan is, um, we don't know if this is going to work because we've never done it before, but we're going to just cut off this connector expose the positive and negative wiring and then we're going to wire that directly to the the electrics in in the van itself but before we're going to do that we're not going to get everything fixed in we're going to do uh, like a bench test so i've just got this uh, small little test battery 12 volt test battery so we're going to get it all wired up um, make sure it all works and after we've done that then we're going to get them actually wired into the to the headliner as well Got the bench test now all wired up. Um, so this is just wired directly, really roughly into the, this battery at the moment. Um, clipped the uh, wireless module and I've just, just bound those wires together really now just, just to test. So here is the remote, moment of truth. Probably can't see actually, because it's really bright, but yep, there we go. I know they're flashing, but um, that is because these uh, do have a flashing mode as well. So. 
really happy with that. Bench test worked. Um, no issues there at all. So it's all working as expected. So now that's all working as a sort of a dry test, um, gonna get all of these sort of um, positioned on the headliner, get the wires popped through and um, just route all of these back to one, one single point. Um, and then we'll be ready to do the, the first fix of the wiring um, into the van. Very happy, yay. Back in the van now. So I have um, just wired up the, the module, um, the wireless, um, sorry, remote module in. I've got that, that crimped into some uh, 12 volt wire. So the 12 volt, volt wire, <laughs> excuse me, um, is now running behind the, uh, the door pillar just there. Um, and that's gonna run along eventually to where our, all of our electrics are, are gonna terminate. So um, wired it back into the, the little block and then when I come to fit all of the LEDs, they're all gonna wire back to, to this point here. So we're gonna be having the, the block fixed. So if we need to get at the, the connectors, we, we can do that here. In terms of coverage, so we are gonna refit the original uh, plastic cover here that covers all of the, the wiring and get the wiring all um, secured in on the bodywork as well. So that's where we're up to now. Next bit, just come round to the back, is we're gonna start fixing the LEDs themselves actually onto, onto the panel. So we're gonna get those evenly spaced, get those fixed, test the wiring again, and then finally we'll be hopefully refitting the, the liner with our nice new lights. Let's go. So just quickly then, how these particular lights fit into the uh, the headliner. So these are, they're not recessed, they're, they're sort of the surface mounted LEDs. So to get these to, to fit, it's just a case of drilling a little hole in the headliner itself. And then the wires, just kind of pop through, pull those through. So the LED um, top, you know, just a, the silver bezel that unscrews, and then underneath you've got two sort of screw holes where you can screw those then directly into into the headliner, and then get the uh, the bezel and the cover back on top. LED is now fixed to the the uh, roof liner, which is all good. So I'm just going to reverse them now, and just going to reroute all of the wires so that they all sort of terminate at, at the same point. Um, and then I'm going to do another test just to make sure everything is, is still working before we do our, our final fit in the van. So here we are, moment of truth for the first four lights. Little battery powered up. Three, two, one. Yay! <laughs> oh, well, that's a surprise. Uh, first time. All right, let's, um, let's try the other two on the other panel. Hopefully it'll keep going that way. And the Lord said, let there be light, and there was light. Cool, right, now I've just gotta get these fit and hopefully it'll all still work <laughs> once all the panels are in place. So that is the new headliner and LED lights all in. Just gotta do the um, joining strips, but yeah, pretty much done now. Really happy with how that's gone. Got my little remote here, so lights are working um, on remote even got some party modes on there as well <laughs> so yeah really happy with that it's um yeah it's been a little bit tricky wiring was a little bit difficult to, to get it all back to the um to the right place but yeah really happy with that um, really good stage and good to see the van with uh, some electricity in it as well so yeah um looking forward to the next part thanks for watching guys bye